Okay, the garden update for June 2024. So these are, that is actually watermelon that I just put like a week ago. Um, so the cauliflower didn't do good. The broccoli didn't do good. It's too hot. It's, this is like a cool weather crop. I think it's better in the fall. So we have jalapeno pepper there. We have a uh, uh, yellow bell pepper there, which is starting. Then we have all of these tomatoes, which is Jet Star. All of these tomatoes started. There should be four plants in the front. Then there's tomato, beefsteak tomato should be four. One, two, three, four. They all started as well. Most of them have tomatoes on them. And we have a green bell pepper here. There's one there, one there. That's a green bell pepper. And let's see, behind there is uh, this one here is a cantaloupe melon. Then these are watermelon. This right here is watermelon in the pot. There's like three or four plants. There's some flowers growing there. This one is the biggest one, the Japanese eggplant. I forgot the name. Uh, promo. That's a uh, proposal. Let's see if we can see it. Prosperosa, okay. Eggplant. That's doing really good. Has a lot of flowers. About to make some eggplants on there. Each each plant is in just this little container here, and it's doing really good. Versus without the container in ground, these were planted at the same time. It kind of got overrun by mint and strawberries. Then we have uh, a cherry tomato plant over here they have some small tomatoes on there then in the back we have early girl tomato which has some nice tomatoes on there there's a lot of tomatoes this season we have a potato plant in the back which probably has a ton of tomatoes like a 10 gallon planting uh, container now over here this is uh, zucchinis which I don't think there's any female flowers yet. Then this is cucumber. There's a ton of flowers. There's already five or six cucumbers starting. Okay, that's corn in the back in a container. This is corn in ground. Um, all of this, the strawberries, I've picked already a few times. I have to keep picking them every day, otherwise uh, insects get them because they're ripe. They get them. These, this is the blueberry. These are the little grapes. Grapes are growing. This is the grapevine. And this is the apple tree. There's one apple tree here and one apple tree there. I try to put all the apples in the nets so the squirrels can't get them. But I have a lot that are not in the net. Like all of these one, two, three, four, five, six. There's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You can't even see it, so I blend it in. But there's tons of apples on this tree. The thing grew to like 20 feet. And that's it. No spotted lantern fly that I don't see yet this season didn't start. So that's about it for now. Check back in another two weeks, see what's going on.